Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is Helton's Computer Repair. On this tutorial, we're going to be showing you how you can access and use the Voice Recorder app in Windows 10. Yes, Windows 10 automatically has the program called Voice Recorder installed on your computer. Now, technically, if it's not there, I'll be showing you how you can get it there, download it and install it from the Microsoft App Store, and it's pretty simple, straightforward. Now, to just to let you know, I can show you about this program, but if you don't have a mic or like a microphone um, for a headset that has that ability, you may not be able to do this until you actually get one, but well, at least you'll know where the program is at. So let's go ahead and just jump right into this video. So first thing you do, by default, Windows 10 should automatically have this program installed. So you'll go to Start, and you'll scroll down until you see Voice Recorder, and pretty much here is the program. Now here it is asking to, if you want to allow to let access to this recording. For this microphone, I'm going to go ahead and press yes, and that would pretty much would trigger it for it to work. So here I am testing, 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 and there's the file that got saved right here. Once it's there, you can pretty much open the file location, and there's your recording, and you have it saved wherever you want it. It's pretty much that simple. Now, if it comes to a point, if you do have different devices, you might need to go to the right down corner, and here's the Microsoft settings and you might need to choose a different one if you had a different microphone depending on what you have on the device but it's only if you have additional ones like that but if you don't have this program installed because that was pretty simple just straightforward I'm going to be showing you how you can actually get this program installed so I'm going to go ahead and pretend like this and I'm going to go uninstall this program just to show you here's voice recorder I'm going to press uninstall so now it's pretty much gone so pretending that we don't have this program installed, so you're like, where the heck? I don't see it. Well, then all we're going to do is go ahead and go to the Microsoft App Store right here. And let me go ahead and expand this. And then from there on the search bar on the right, I'm going to type in voice recorder. And here it is, the same icon again. And you're going to wonder if this is not a third party. This should say it's from Microsoft Corporation straight directly right here. And all you have to do is press get, and it might prompt us to us you want to sign in. I'm going to press no because I don't need to. It's an option for you all if you want to do that. Um, I, I won't technically need it. And let the program just download and install. So here it is. Tells us that the voice recorder pretty much got installed in there. You can go ahead and click the launch right there if you want to. And here's the program. Here it is asking for the same thing. If you want to allow access, I'm going to go ahead and press yes. And it's pretty much that simple. So here I am testing, 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 and everything works good. If you don't want the file anymore, you can simply just delete the file. You can rename the file. You actually, I think you also have the ability to share, but that depends if you have like the ability set up for your email system. But that is pretty much it. Thanks for watching from Helton's Computer Repair, and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching guys. If you just like this video, then hit that button. But if you like it and you want to see more, hit that like button. Get subscribed, comment, and tell us what other tech videos you want to see. Consider checking out our merch store. Link in the video description. And for the rest, I will see you on the next video.